for more on this story, we can go across to Nick Spicer standing by in Berlin. Nick, what prompted this decision? I think it was a matter of insubordination, which underlined Annegret Kramp-Karrenbauer's lack of authority over the party. What happened in Thuringia, which is in part of the is part of a land in the region in the former East Germany, is that Christian Democratic Union uh, party officials, that's Angela Merkel's party, uh, voted alongside members of the Alternative for Germany to elect as premier a man coming from a third party. He did not stay in office for more than 24 hours before resigning uh, in a scandal. So you had there an example of the local Christian Democrats not listening to their national party leader. She went down to try to persuade them to hold a new vote, and she came away saying that the matter remains unresolved, that the Christian Democratic Union doesn't know how it can deal with the far right and the far left. Um, this came after Angela Merkel, the German chancellor, who has been trying to step off the national political stage, putting Annegret kramp karrenbauer into her uh, job as party leader, said that the election of this man with the Christian Democratic Union votes was unforgivable and needed to be reversed, and she proved herself unable to reverse it. So that, that is a, that's what precipitated her uh, announcement that she will not be running as chancellor. And Nick, what does this say about the influence of the AFD in shaping German politics at the national level? Well, I think it shows that the AFD has a significant uh, role. It's now present in all 16 German regions. It is the de facto opposition party in the federal parliament, even though it only has only 12% uh, of the vote. The rule has been for these sort of big tent parties, the Christian Democrats and the Social Democrats, uh, to never govern with the far right, whether it's at the municipal, uh, regional or national level. They are just toxic and they must not be dealt with. Now, this election was the first time that the Christian Democrats have voted, some say inadvertently, with the far right since World War II. So it was an earthquake when it occurred. Um, it, so it looks like the far right has a disruptive uh, effect, if you will, on national political uh, uh, events, because what happened regionally caused the national leader of Angela Merkel's party to resign and underline her lack of authority. But they're still not entering in governments at the national level uh, or at the regional level. So it's more of a power, if you will, uh, to cause harm and to block things from happening than actual power in itself. Nick, thank you very much for the update. Nick Spicer reporting there from Berlin.